Welcome to this lecture. In this lecture, we are going to discuss modular programming in assembly language. So for this, we are going to discuss about macros and procedures. Macro is used for small number of lines over for maximum 10 to 15 number of lines and procedure can be used for as you want to write but declaration of macro macro is some like a function in any other language in any other programming language so here macro name is the procedure name and these are the variable separated by comma and here are the statements suppose if I want to display message like in our previous program here we want to display message 1 2 3 4 and so many times so we can use macros instead of we are going to write every time three lines so note we declare macro topmost of the program so now we can declare macro like this way and end m so calling of a macro call macro name and the variable that you want to give and we call macro in the body of program so here is the example of the macro like you want to display the string in this way so you can use macro so for this CLS edit and here we can use macro so like here at the end of the program so simply write str this play so the keyword macro str one variable and and m now we are going to display message move wh zero nine edge move dx offset str and interrupt 21 edge so save it and after that call the macro and like here cut all these lines and convert it into str test and after that our assembly program is like this str str disk play enter also here str display and here also you can write like this so i hope you will like this lecture because the advantage of macro and also str display 
enter str display string 3 and then only we are going to write the length so by using this way so this is fine so now save the program exit imagine so there is no error good sign and after that link now exe file and same like seven practice six length and this is all about macro so now edit our program and the next one is procedure procedure is declaration of procedure is like here procedure name and the proc and statements are here so we can call like note we declare it last most of the program but before the end statements so call procedure name like we are going to write in this way so after this statement call procedure and procedure will be call and after this statement procedure call and here is the procedure that is used to display the statements so this is all about procedure and here is the end of the procedure so i want to use macro because it is simple procedure is also simple you can use like this this is valid program and at the end of the program you can write this statement before the end of the program add procedure into your program but procedure will be used whenever our statements will be more than 15 over 10 so macro will be used for when our lines are 10 thank you for watching this video